What is going on gamers and welcome back to the Gaming Aaron channel. We're going to be playing The Walking Dead. We're we'll starting out with Season 1, I guess you could say. I am super excited for it. I cannot wait to play it. I've got all the episodes downloaded. And this has been one of my favorite games back in the day when it first came out back in 2012. I remember playing this game all the way through. And I remember playing Season 2 all the way through. And I don't think I played any of the newer ones at all, so that's going to be interesting whenever we get around to that. But I just wanted to go ahead and start out with the OG of the Walking Dead Telltale games. Um, I am so excited. I don't know if you guys have heard, but if you guys know what the game The Wolf Among Us is, they have recently announced that they're going to be releasing The Wolf Among Us Part 2, Season 2, whatever they are calling it. I'm so looking forward to that. I cannot wait. But if you guys want to see me go play Season 1 of that, just let me know and I'll uh, I'll look into doing that. But I'm super excited to do The Walking Dead. I cannot wait to jump into it. This has been one of my longtime favorite games. And it was such a good game back in the day for 2012. Um, I honestly cannot remember many games that did come out that year. Because I was probably right around 12 to 13 years old when this game came out. And I don't actually know if I played it the exact year that it came out. I think, never mind, no, I think I did. I think I did. Because I played it originally on my PlayStation 3. That's when I originally played it. But it's been so long. Uh, if I go ahead and click play here, you can already see that I got a game save on my PC from 400 days back maybe four years ago again i do not remember any of this i don't remember this game save even being a thing so like i i don't know anything about this but we'll just select down here i guess just for simplicity's sake but we're going to go ahead and click the play button and jump right into this i cannot wait i hope you guys are excited so choose a display style we got standard and minimal Turn off UI hints, help, and choice notification. Uh, I think we'll just go with standard. That's the standard way of playing that I like to play. So we got all the different episodes up here. We're just going to start, like, you know, we can go through them right here. But we'll start with episode one, A New Day. And for those of you OGs who remember this game, I'm sure you guys remember how this game is going to start. This game adapts to the choices you make. I'll wait. In association with Skybound Entertainment, The Walking Dead. Now, for those of you who do not know, this has nothing to do with the TV series. And if you've never played this game, you're in for a treat. I swear, you you really are. You're in for a treat be really fun it's our boy ah, it's our boy it's so good to see him again oh well I reckon you didn't do it then Use the mouse wheel or the number keys to select a response. Does it really matter? Nah, not much. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Every time? Every time. Every time. Oh, okay. So, here we go. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. You're from Macon, then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real 
of shame, that is. Uh oh. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? I got much choice. I got much choice? Sure don't. What was that look, bro? <laughs> what Regardless, was that look? Could be you just married the wrong woman. Who? <laughs> uh, I probably don't want to say that. Uh, I thought I selected that. Let's be pretty serious. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. And before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed. Stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed in himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Well, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more... Officer, watch out! Watch out! This other time... Oh man, that don't sound too good. That don't look too good. Officer? Hey! Hey, officer! Are you alright? I'm still cut back here! Officer? Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Yeah, that don't seem too good. This will kick the window out, try to get out of here. Really? After one kick, it made that big that big of a hole? These are actually a whole lot harder just to get out of. So, just hope you know. I need to drag myself out that window. I'm going, I'm going. Ah! 
Ooh. That cannot be healthy whatsoever. All right, officer, I need your weapon or your keys. I need something, something to get these cuffs off. Can I get the shotgun and like shoot off the cuffs? Probably wouldn't work out too well. Shotgun shells over there. Hello, officer. That's a lot of blood. Officer. I don't God think he's gonna damn. be waking up. Officer. Where's the keys? Let me grab those. I need those to unlock the cuffs. Shit. <laughs> oh man. All right. Are you guys ready for this? Why'd you hesitate so much like that? Oh, did you guys see that? I thought I saw him move. Officer? Officer? Oh! Holy shit! You gotta get back, gotta get back! Oh, grab the shotgun, grab it, grab it. Oh, put it in there, come on. Come on, oh, really, really, really? Okay, hey, 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 all right, come on, come on, come on. Don't make me do this! Oh, oh, that was brutal. That was really brutal. Like, for someone who doesn't know what, like, zombies are... Oh. Hello? Help! Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! What's that? Uh-oh. Oh, come on, get up. You got this. Now you got an injured leg, but keep going. Oh, you better get up. It's crazy to see these things already so decayed. These thing uh, and this outbreak pretty much just happened. Hello, anybody? It's also really crazy to see how much society can fall apart that quickly with a zombie outbreak. Got a tea set over here. I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. <laughs> yeah. Anybody up there? Help! Probably not. I wouldn't say so. But I guess we'll just explore the environment a little bit, see what we got to work with here, like what's going on. can't go back out there yeah probably wouldn't be a wise idea we got we got a lucky break for uh with, with someone shooting in the background drawing the attention of those walkers away but what i was pretty much saying 
if you can hear me. <laughs> but pretty much what I was saying earlier is that, I mean, would that really be anyone else's first instinct if, like, they seen a monster like that crawling towards them that looked like they died? You would get your uh, shotgun and shoot them. I mean, I mean, yeah. If, I guess if, if that makes sense, really. It's like, wouldn't you still like think that maybe they're human? Instead of just taking the shotgun and blowing their head off, because I mean, you could hear him. Is there anybody here? You could hear him um, saying he didn't want to do it. I don't know. Let's go ahead and go try to get in the house, I guess. We ain't really got any other options, I suppose. I wonder if anybody's home. Uh, I don't know. Go ahead and knock. Don't shoot, okay? Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Yeah, it's safe to say that maybe someone's not here. I hope than I do. Yeah, based off of uh, the, the grape juice that's over here on the ground and the wall and whatnot. That's a lot of grape juice. I need to clean up that mess. It's fake, damn. Fake fruit. Why would you have fake fruit on the table like that, bro? Someone's on the answering machine. Three new messages. Message one left at 5:43 p.m. Hey Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. But anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, left at 11:19 p.m. Oh my God! Finally, I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. Wow, that is that is really heartbreaking. Just hearing those messages. So I could not imagine being put in that scenario where you're just separated from your child. You're not getting an answer back. That's gotta be rough. Hello? You need to be quiet. Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Uh... Where are your parents? Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Ah! 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 
Oh god, oh god, okay, okay. Alright, I'm guessing this is Sandra. We figured out what happened to her. Oh god, oh god, Lee, come on, man. Lee, come on. Oh, uh, come on, kick her off. Oh god, Sandra, get off me! Go, go, get out of here. Thank you. Alright, Clementine, look away. You don't need to see this. Oh. Alright, um, yeah, Clementine, you didn't need to see that. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen. Alright, I guess we gotta go through this number again. I wasn't quick enough, I suppose. Alright, alright, alright. Clementine, for real. Hang on, let me get this girl off me. Oh, come on. Alright, give me that. Give me that, Cle give me the hammer. You need, to, you need to look away. Oh. Oh, right in the face. Oh. Oh, Clementine, look away. Look away right now, Clementine. I think we got it. I think we got it. Oh, gosh, that is messed up. Oh, <laughs> God. Man. That's what I'm saying, Lee. <laughs> Uh, I think something else I did. Something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Two nights oh. ago? Yeah, that's probably what happened. It's been happening that long? You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh, look for help before it gets dark. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. It really isn't. Let's go. Stay close to me. That is crazy, though, that this, like, outbreak... I mean, I, I kind of would assume that this would be the case, but it's crazy that this outbreak happened, like, two days prior to me on the way to jail. <laughs> like, it's crazy that was happening, because, like, you'd think it'd be in the news, but, I don't know, I guess it started out kind of slow, and then just, like, bam, hit all at once. I don't know. But, I think I'm gonna call episode one here off and then continue on in the next episode so if you guys enjoyed this one be sure to leave a like and a comment don't forget to subscribe and i shall see you guys in the next episode on our adventures with lee and clementine if you guys are excited as i am bye, -bye!